everyone, I'm back with another haul. This is my big Dollar Tree haul. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to show I think is pretty cool. So, the Dollar Tree, at least the Dollar Tree by my house, they were putting out quite a bit of different new things out today, or maybe they had it out yesterday, but I, I don't go every day, but I go pretty much every day. I'm all, the Dollar Tree is not that far from my house. It's maybe, walking would be a half hour, but driving there it's only like maybe five minutes, if that. It's like right up the street. So I go there anytime I have a little bit of money or anytime um, I see something that someone's told and I think, oh my gosh, I need that. I'll run up there because it's just right there. But um, these um, I know must be new because I did not see them. I believe I went either yesterday or the day before yesterday and um, they weren't there then. But anyways, the point was they were there today. So um, they had these chef um, themed dishes and cups out. I've never seen them there before. Um, but my mom has our kitchen. She did the theme chef because she really likes the chef theme and she thought it was cute. So we got her some of the chef stuff they had there. So this is what the cups look like. Super cute. And we got her two of the cups. And then we got her two of the bowls. And this is what the bowls look like. And there's two of them, but they both look the same. And then we got her two of the plates. And both plates look the same as well. So we got her just two of each for now. So we got those. Super duper cute. So got those. The next things I have here was is the Doll Tree had a bunch of new movies in. And we all know how I am with movies. As you can see, my shelf is getting full. Um, on the other side of this shelf, there's a shelf here. There's my TV right here. On um, Right next to my TV, I have... Um, it's like a CD rack, I think it's supposed to be. But I have DVDs now on that. And it's pretty much full, too. So now I don't know where I'm going to be putting these. But I found... A quite a bit of movies. I think there's some more somewhere else in another bag, but um, I'll get to those ones later when I find them. But, yes. So the first movie I found, I pretty much grabbed all the ones that I thought that I would like. Or that um, you know, I could watch with my little sister because weekends um, in the summertime there was almost every night my little sister and my little brother were um, wanting to be with me and watching movies, so we would kind of veg out. Oh, here they are in front of the TV and we'd watch movies together at night and now that school started um, my little sister usually how it goes is on the weekends my little sister when she's not in school likes to hang out with me and we watch movies on the weekends together so I picked these ones out to watch with her. I got this was a two pack actually so it was a pretty good deal for a dollar. You get two of the Sonic movies in there. So I thought they might be fun to watch with her and it's um, this one is Underground, The Queen, Alina, Chronicles, and then the other one is Under Sonic Underground, Dr. Robo, Tink's Revenge. So, I don't know. I like the game Sonic. Maybe these will be cool to watch. I've never seen them. And then I found the Super Mario Brothers Super Show Box Office Mario one. Um, my little sister has a Mario one, so I know she'll like watching this one, too. And I like Mario, so maybe it'll be cool to watch the show. I don't know. But for a dollar, why not? Then I got this movie called Terry. And I think I've seen this one before, but I don't really remember it much. So I got this one. And this is what it's about if you want to pause. Then I got this one called Struck by Lightning. Um, it says written by and starring Chris Colfer from Glee. And that's what that one's about, if you can see. And then this one's called Sophie and Sheba, the story of a big friendship. And when I saw this, I immediately got excited because it's obviously about an elephant. And we all know I just love elephants. So, got that one. Don't know if it's going to be any good or not, but it has an elephant. So I thought, why not? Then they had the complete first season of 21 Jump Street. And this is a season. So I was like, season? What? complete first season a dollar why the heck not 
I've never seen the show before, but maybe it's good. I don't know. We'll find out now. And then the next one I got was called Cemetery Junction. I don't know. I mean, I'm always watching movies, and I mean, I can't not pass up dollar movies. I can't. I If I see a movie for a dollar, just I have to punch up, I go nuts. Then I found The Adventures of Super Mario Brothers 3, so another Mario one, and it looks like you get one, two, three, four, five, six episodes per one, so got that one as well. Then I got this movie called Lullaby, and I never actually read what a movie's about. I kind of just look at the case, look at the pictures, and think, okay, this one looks like it could be good, and I'll get it. I don't never really sit there and take the time to read what it's about. I don't got time for all that. Then I got this one called Two Days in Paris. And that's what that one's about. And then my boyfriend picked out this one called Beyond the Trophy. This one don't look like my cup of tea, but... Hmm, could be good. And then... I got this. I've, I've never seen this show before, but again, it's a box set. So, for a dollar, brand new, I'm not going to pass it up. It's called The Jeff Corwin Experience. It's an Animal Planet um, TV show. I've never watched it. It, I don't know what it's about. I don't really like snakes, but maybe it'll be an interesting show enough for a dollar. So, I got it. I mean, it's a complete season. So, went ahead and picked it up. And then I found um, this Care Bears Cuddles in Carolot one. And you get, it looks like, I don't know, six, I think, episodes or something like that. But I thought this would be cute maybe to watch my little sister. She used to love Care Bears. I'm talking we would watch Care Bears when she was a toddler every day. Um, we have a big age gap. I'm 24. She's now 11. But when I was in high school, um, our parents worked every day. And I would be watching her, you know, and every day, it was the Care Bears. All day, every day. Non-stop. Back-to-back. Care Bears, Care Bears. But now she doesn't really watch it, but I thought maybe she'll get in a Care Bear mood again. You never know. So, got it. Um, the next things I have here are um my boyfriend picked out this like door knocker decoration for my mom. So, got that. And then, uh, looks like he got himself just a pair of socks. Boring. And then, we got two door, he got two door covers. This one, it looks like that. And then this one, this says trick or treat. I like this one. Okay, so got those. Um, the next thing I got is just some bubble mail mailers. For mailing, like friend mail or whatever. And then um, he got a table cover. And then he got two pot holders that have spiders. It's two packs, so that's a good deal. So we got those. And then the matching hand towel. So got those. Then the next thing I found here is I found these for um, um, No Guts, No Glory. Um, she had mentioned that she was looking for these. I'm hoping these are the right ones. I'm pretty sure they are. Because she said they were the owls and they kind of look like metal. And she was saying that she was looking for one or two of them. Well, I wasn't sure if she had found one or two yet or not. But the Dollar Tree that I went to, I don't normally go to this Dollar Tree. But they were just literally putting them all out. And so they had a whole bunch. So I thought... I would grab two of them just in case. So, I got those for her. Yes. So, got those. And then, let's see. And then it looks like um, some more hand towels, the chef ones. I'm assuming those are for my mom. Some of the stuff my, um, um, my boyfriend picked out. 